we're living in this consensus reality. So many where it's 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 a giant hive. It's a giant hive of human beings that have that have gathered here based upon who knows? Who knows? Who knows what was the first first human being? It's like it's like a beehive, alright? Each bee has its own individual personality, and that's what you are. You're a bee, and you've got a mission. And your mission is the mission of the hive. According to the hive. But humans have this thing here where they don't really have to do, they don't really have to be stuck in the hive. They don't really have to do anything. The only thing they have to do is what they think they have to do. They don't have to do anything. The only thing they have to do, this is going to sound really cliche, and I never understood it for so long when all these people said it. But the only thing you have to do is whatever you want. Do whatever you want. You know, that's all the bee is doing. The bee wants to contribute to its bee society. Because it finds reasoning. The human wants to develop itself wants to express itself you know, you know because that's kind of what the hive trained it to do because the hive is the mind they're not all out to get you you're just realizing, you're just noticing, coming up with your own explanation of what's going on. But the hive is not your enemy. The hive has always had the best intentions. Best in their perception. Because, of course, that's all what good and bad is. Is according to motivations of an individual. And in this case, the collective the collective has become a giant individual. A giant organism. But it's always been this way. It's always been this way. And you're here to help it out. But see, here's the problem is that we see the collective as being, you know, just the humans, just our race, but really, it's all of anything. It's the earth, it's the cosmos, it's the dirt, it's the grass, it's the bugs, there's no way to not serve karma 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 is action all right it's it's serving without expecting anything in return you don't have to expect anything in return because you will get something in return because you are absolutely everything. Everything is your mind. And you cannot not get energy. You cannot lose energy. Because that's all any of this is. Is energy. Sculpting itself. You know, and it comes from it comes from Do you know about the idea of the collective, the collective unconscious? 
you know, it's like that, it's not like that just for humans, it's like that for, for everything, because you are tapped in to absolutely everything, because everything is just in the perception of this human in which you are perceiving from. That's right. You're not the human. You're perceiving from the human. You are the awareness that is aware of being human. When you're doodling, doodle. Where does that come from? That's nature. That is the flow of nature. That's beyond human. You are human now, but you are beyond human. And when it really gets down to it, you are beyond nature. You are beyond space, time, everything that is physical is also mystical. It's also mystical. Everything that is physical, everything that is spiritual, is physical. Everything is here, right now. What is this? What is this protruding from your cheek? It's all here right now. You just can't see it. There are infinite entities you know, trying to get your attention. Thoughts. All of these thoughts, all of these thoughts are entities. They're trying to gain your attention. They're trying to pull you close. 